going to show you my top 5 during this quarantine. So let's get started. There are 5 different categories and I'm going to start with what I've been watching. So the first show I've been starting to watch and I thought it was a really good idea <laughs> for myself because I never watched it all the way, just maybe a few episodes but not really, uh, was Sex and the City. I, I was too young when it came out so I really never watched it. I've been pretty consistent on watching it. Something that I also really liked and discovered during quarantine was watching Paddington. I know it's a kid's movie but I never thought it would be such a funny movie and I watched Paddington 1 and Paddington 2 and totally recommend watching those movies. It's a happy movie for quarantine so it's perfect. Another thing that I've been watching that I asked, I finished already but I really like and I want to suggest to you guys is Unorthodox. Super trendy at the moment. I watch it in two days and I could have watched it in one day actually but it was kind of late and I was a bit ashamed of being up so late just watching this show so I really recommend that show. The next one is called The Stranger, it's like a secrecy, you don't really know what's going on series so it also keeps you want to watch it all the time. And the last show that I also really like is called Self Made, it's a mini series as well as Unorthodox and I really liked it, I know it was like a happy, a bit dramatic but overall super positive energy which is what I want to watch when I'm in quarantine and I have all these emotions in my head. I don't want to be watching something too dramatic or too serious because then I feel even worse. I need something to cheer me up, something happy, a bit silly and distracting. On the next category, which consists of what I've been doing the most, I've been painting. I never thought I would say that. I never even thought I could paint. I've been using watercolor. So this is the thing that I have. <laughs> I can do a mini haul. I have this to put all the paints in there. Uh, my sister got me also this uh, mini booklet so I could start doing my drawings. I did some avocados, a peach, you know, a whale, different things that I've been just enjoying doing something new. And I have here the colors, super basic. I dropped the white one. Super basic colors, but what do you need for learning? And of course, um, some brushes to paint. The next thing I've been doing as every other student is doing summary studying. I'm spending quite a lot of time doing that, so it's nothing interesting, but I was able to pull through and do it, which I'm pretty happy about because at the beginning I was like, I'm not in the mood for any of this and I have to do it regardless. So it was quite a mental challenge at the beginning. What I've been doing as well is YouTube, clearly. <laughs> it's a really good way of the, distracting myself, try to think about content and then getting the ideas into a video. So that's a really nice way of distracting my mind and prevent myself from overthinking about the situation. And the classic quarantines, I've been sleeping a lot and I've been trying to read. It took me weeks to get myself to get a book and read it. But I have a book and I read it and finished it and I really like it. I would recommend it but it's in Spanish so um, I will put the name here in case some of you guys speak Spanish uh, so you can read it. I really really liked it. It's a historical novel about um, Barcelona and the hospital here that is a modernist, super, super pretty hospital and I really liked it. As I said, I've been sleeping a lot, taking quite some naps. I don't sleep well at night. I think everybody's on the same page. We don't sleep that well at night. So I take naps sometimes if I have time during the day because that's the actual time during the day that I rest fully. Like I feel like I had a pretty decent um, sleep. I have nothing else to do sometimes, so I just indulge and <laughs> take a nap, you know, like who's gonna tell me otherwise? Nobody, right? The next category is about what I've been eating the most. I have to confess that I've been eating something that I didn't know the name till now because I googled it, but in Spanish it's called Obelea. I'll put it over here. I think it's called Wafer. I never heard of it. This is the Obelea Wafer. It comes in a bag like this. I put a pin, so it doesn't go bad or something and it's super thin I'm gonna show you so you can see but it's a really thin it's like teeny teeny 
tiny thin and it's a bit sweet but not too crazy and it has like this really cool pattern it's my childhood in a plastic bag i've been eating my wafers away because it's so nice it's not too sweet i'm not a huge fan of sweet stuff i just like it i have an obsession i keep buying it i have to stop it but it's quarantine i want to indulge in something too the next thing that i've been doing a lot is drinking a lot of teas so i have here a selection of teas that i can show you this one that is basically mint tea it has no caffeine so it's good for night time so i don't feel restless on top of not being able to sleep properly the ones with caffeine that i have are from horny mint and are these two they're called veggies i think they are pretty <laughs> trendy right now i presume because of this uh, vegetable and like green tea and this really interesting ingredient so this one is with carrot orange uh peach and turmeric uh, yeah i really liked it and i also bought this one they haven't tried yet and uh, that is with ginger and matcha and spinach pear and green tea now it's getting a bit warmer but when it was colder <laughs> when this whole thing started i was having a lot of teas because my house is pretty cold so it was a good way and cheaper way of warming myself up my last eating thing is amazing i've been eating this for months actually and it's so 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 good it's these two combined together so this is the kefir i don't know how you say kefir i have no idea this type of yogurt that is a bit more liquidy and i've been putting it with blueberries i'm like low-key saving this because i know myself and i can eat it all day long every single day and then i'll decide because i don't have any more and i have to wait till i go and buy more at the supermarket so i'm just trying to save up the next category is surprise surprise exercise i've been doing a lot of exercise throughout these days keeps me moving going energetic power through this situation and what i've been doing the most is some workouts from pop sugar i've been also trying because my best friend recommended body combat and that i've done before as well and the ones that i really like that she also recommended is called less meals i don't know like i will also right here and i will put everything in the description box as well so you can check them out i'm also doing that i've been doing also in the past before is yoga and the one that i really like lately because it's also super motivational is called travis elliott i will also link the channel down below and one that i also recently discovered for like really longer intensity exercises is sydney cummins she's also super motivating keeps you like you know push you through even if you're just dying and want to quit i really like her as well the last thing i'm going to be talking about is what i've been wearing the most and for that i'm going to make it long story short because i did a video about this that i will link over here so you can go and check it out but as you can imagine it's mostly sweatpants and sweatshirts i cannot be bothered to get dressed unless it's a video of course i'm not gonna be in my pjs but it's just impossible like I haven't wear tight jeans for so long actually the other day was my birthday so I wore those for the first time in potentially two months I just want to be comfortable I don't really want to look that good of course I feel better if I am a bit more like put together and with makeup and my hair done but most of the times I'm like screw this I'm surviving I'm gonna wear what I want just let me be so that was it video thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe over here and i'll see you in the next one bye